Hi, we are going to be drawing 3D shapes in this lesson. And so you're going to need a ruler, or if you don't have a ruler, then find like a piece of cardboard with awesomely straight edges. Um, and then you're also going to need a pencil. I'm gonna use a whiteboard marker because pencil doesn't seem to work on whiteboards very well. Um, and then you're also going to need dot paper, um, square dot paper and or, uh, triangular dot paper is best. Here's triangular, so it looks like makes rectangles instead of squares with the dots. Um, and uh, I put that in the printables if you are on my lesson. If you're on YouTube, you won't find it there. Um, but you can just find it online. It's easy. So um, for our square dot paper, we are going to practice drawing a rectangular pyramid. And I chose square dot paper, paper because a rectangle um, fits onto this shape easily. Um, and then, uh, yeah, we're going to draw a triangular prism on the triangle dot paper because a triangle fits easily on there. I could I could draw everything on a square dot paper um, or a rectangular dot paper. I mean, a triangular dot paper. Um, it's just yeah, it's just easier with different ones based on what the what the base is of each shape. So uh, first of all, we are going to draw a rectangle. If you can see this here, there we go. All right. So take our ruler, and my lines aren't very straight because I did draw this myself. I don't have a printer at home. Uh, so we're just going to pretend that uh, my my dots are really nice and straight here. Yeah, that dot goes right there. <laughs> so it's going to be um, four dots long, and we're going to go uh, one, one, two, three, four, five dots across. No, actually, I'm going to go six. just because it centers it up. Centers it nicer. <laughs> And then we're going to go four dots again. One, two, three, four. And then we're going to connect it as my ruler erases my whiteboarding. <laughs> All right. And then with a pyramid, since we only have one base for pyramids, then you just pick a point above somewhere. Um, I'm going to pick right here. And then you connect all corners to this point, to the apex, as you learned in the last lesson. And there we go. Trying to go over it a bit there. <laughs> So that is, you can't see that very well, can you? There we go. Well, they're kind of wavy now though, but you can see them better. So this is a rectangular pyramid. Here's the rectangle part, and then it meets at one point. So that makes it a pyramid. Um, and then next we are going to draw, just draw where my marker went here. Oh, there it is, my marker lid. <laughs> All right, so we're gonna flip this over. There we go. And now we can draw the other shape, which is the triangular prism. So prisms have two bases and one, um, I mean, uh, not one, <laughs> two bases and connects with rectangles. So here we go. You can watch right here. So um, my ruler is right here. So I need to first make a, make a triangle. So I'm going to go two up, two down. Oops. It's not that easy to use a ruler with a whiteboard. A little vertical space. OK, so now I've made one triangle. And it goes one, two, one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three. It has three dots for each line. So wherever I put my other or triangle, I don't know if I think I just called that a rectangle. Wherever I put my triangle. My other triangle has to be exactly the same size, but in a different way. So we just pick a different spot. We want to go up some and over some. So um, I am going to go right here. And so we're going to go three dots, three dots, and three dots, as I try not to erase all the dots with my hand. Um, and then we are going to connect each of the corners 
like this one and this one together, and then this one and this one together, and then this one and this one together, because they are um, opposite each other. And so you please use a ruler because you have paper and a pencil and you're not doing it on a whiteboard. Um, there we go. So there is a triangular prism on a triangular dot paper and then a rectangular pyramid on a square dot paper. All right. So I hope you have fun. You're going to have to draw different ones, whatever it says, like just start with the base. If it says a uh, pentagonal pyramid, start with the pentagon and then split the points. If it says pentagonal prism, draw two pentagons of exactly the same size and then join their same uh, vertices with each other. 